Hello, hello. Welcome to another flip through video. Today we are going to be discussing my latest coloring book, of course, the fabulous, flouncy, frilly, poofy deliciousness that is Rococo A Go Go. Now, what does that even mean? Well, grab a snack. We're going to talk about it. Just a really brief video, three to four minutes, something like that, which is a feat for me to keep things brief, but I'm going to try. So what is Rococo a go, go If you are not familiar with the term a go, go essentially that simply means frivolity. Do whatever you want, frivolousness, galore. Yay, I'm just gonna, I do what I want essentially. So this is Rococo the way that I want. It's Rococo in my Carla blender. So what I did was I took my favorite aspects of the Rococo in terms of fashion, the wigs, the dresses, the accessories, all of that, and they percolated down through my blender and out popped Rococo a go go. Now, this is not at all historically accurate, not at all. The entire premise is if I were to throw a Rococo themed party, but I was planning on playing disco and 80s music. These are the sorts of fashion creatures that I would expect to walk through the doors of my party, right? So once again, not historically accurate. If you are looking for that, you're not going to find it here, okay? Not at all. It is me doing me, hence the a go, -go okay? And as usual, I keep things fairly simple. I purposely omitted backgrounds completely from this book because I want you all to just have fun, which is what I encourage in all of my books. But in this one in particular, because the fashion is a little bit more complicated and a little bit more detailed than it has been in my previous books, I didn't want anybody to get too caught up in the pages. So if you would like to add a background, you can. If you don't want to, you don't have to. A go, go, baby, do whatever you want. That's the whole point of this book. Quick disclaimer. I am not a fan of the Palace of Versailles. I am definitely on team eat the rich. Now you all know I love my French. Just take a look at any of my coloring books and you'll see that I, I adore the French language. I enjoy French food. I enjoy French history. French fashion, clearly. The people of Versailles, not so much, not so much. I'm sorry, they were, they were dirty rich and I'm definitely on team eat the dirty rich. But that being said, they got style correct. And if you know me, if you've been around me on my channels, on my social media, you know, you know that I am an advocate for overcomplicated, uncomfortable, gaudy, ostentatious fashion. I cannot live without a sequin, without a rhinestone. The more ostentatious, the better. And that is why I enjoy the Baroque and the Rococo period. Never mind. The Victorian era, never mind the 70s and 80s. We all know that I love all of that. But to this day, I had not included or worked on anything that was specifically Rococo flavored. So here we are. We're doing the thing. The book is available as both a printable PDF or as a bound soft cover, as usual. The PDF is available exclusively via my Etsy shop and the bound version is available on, on excuse me on amazon all links will be down below as always feel free to simply bookmark my website there you can find my etsy store links to purchase my books everything you need to know is going to be on my website everything you need to know will always be down below thank you for sitting through this video i hope that you enjoy the book i hope you are looking forward to it and please if you do purchase the book Remember, all of my books have a hashtag, so if you are not a shy little creature, tag your pages so that I can see them on Instagram, and that's all I have to say. I hope that you enjoyed it. Happy coloring, my fiends, my coloring weirdos, and I will see you in the next one.